Welcome you all to this video. In this video, we are going to discuss about IPO market, which means how the company is entering into the IPO market. Before getting into this video, in previous video, we all know about stock market and the financial intermediaries. Now, how the company is entering into the IPO market? We will start with an example. An entrepreneur has an idea to kickstart his new business. An early stage business can raise funds through his family or friends or else as an individual also can raise funds if he has a net worth. He is raising money from the family and friends that round is called a seed round which means this is the seed amount he is going to kickstart the business with that amount. Or else he can, he can approach two or more investors to investing in this company to get start his business. That seed amount is also called the initial share capital. A person investing in the company's pre-stage revenue, that person are called angel investors. He can, uh, he can uh, divide the shares, divide the company shares to the investors and the promoters. Now his business is uh, getting slowly uh, success phenomenon. At one particular time, his business reached some more heights. So he is trying to expand his business uh, some more advantages. So he is thinking to raise funds from the professional investors. The professional investors are also called venture capitalists or VCs. They are specialized in investing in the startup companies. Once the professional investor is entering into the company's investment, the promoter, which means an entrepreneur, is not give away his own shares. Apart from that, he is distributing new shares to the professional investors. So the company is earning more revenues and the promoter and the investors creating wealth. After few years, the company expanded globally, which means he is trying to expand his business in international level. For that, he have to raise funds from more ways, which means he can raise funds through in serious process, which means series A, B, C, D or anything, or he can approach one or more investors or professional investors to expand his business globally. For that, he is approaching the professional investors also and he is thinking to go for an IPO, which means the company's shares has been shown to the public and the public is investing in the company's shares. So he chooses an IPO. The IPO market is also called a primary market and the company is listing into the stock exchange is called secondary market. In next video, we will see about how the IPO process works. Before winding up this video, I have to tell you the same thing. Please click the link in the description box if you are interested to open a DMAT account. And don't forget to subscribe our channel also. And please comment about our...